China's Minister of Finance Lao Jiwei said that the AIIB is legally established as the Articles of Agreement take effect on Friday. Lao said the establishment of the AIIB marks a milestone in the reform of global economic governance system. The AIIB will operate after Board of Directors and Executive Council meet for the first time. The meetings are slated to run from January the 16th to the 18th in Beijing. The bank's president will be officially appointed, and the management team will be in place at the meetings. The bank, headquartered in Beijing, now has 57 members. China, India, and Russia are the three largest shareholders. Official says it will always be open to new membership, as its name suggests. The AIIB will finance infrastructure, airports, mobile phone towers, railways, and roads in Asia.